how to view your e-statements and e-advices via Digibank Online. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. I am Bimo from How to Geek and in today's guide video, I will simply show you the way as to how you can go ahead and view your e-statements and your e-advices via Digibank Online. But before we get started, as always, if you are new to our channel, make sure to leave a like and hit the subscribe button. Without any further ado or delay, let us get started with today's video. So first of all, just log into the website portal of DBS Bank for which I will leave a direct link down in the description box. Log into your user ID and your PIN and tap on the login button over here. Once you log into your DBS online banking account, you will see this kind of interface. Now, very first thing you have to do is just simply authenticate your login with your mobile. So you will need to authenticate this transaction with your digital token on your mobile device. Just go ahead and do that. As soon as you've done that and once you've authenticated it, you will see this kind of interface. At the very top, you'll see all this menu bar. Go to the option called My Accounts. Once you go to My Accounts, scroll down and select the option called View E-Statement and E-Advice right over here as you can see. Once you select View E-Statement and E-Advice, you'll see this kind of interface. Now, very first thing you can do is you can see it says View up to 7 years of E-Statement from the date of enrollment. E-Advices are available for 1 year from transaction date. So just go ahead and select your statement type, your statement period as well as sort according to latest month first or latest month last research and just click on the switch button once you do that you'll see all of those statements at the bottom of the screen if you want to view the detailed transaction for each of these statements all you have to do is just simply click on the views PDF button which is at the right hand side of each of the statements and advices which you wish to view and this is simply how you can view your e-statements and e-advices on DBS Bank we hope the video was really helpful and if it did help you make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you've got any more questions queries or doubts make sure to also leave them down thank you very much for watching till the end and see you soon in our next video